Whoa. Hey dudes, my name's Playco, and I've been on fire. Literally, working on some new features in my VR game. So let's get into it. Since a lot of my game is underground, and you have to dig around a lot, it makes sense that it would be pretty dark in a lot of places. So the player needs a way to actually see what they're doing. And for that, I need lights. But like, interactive lights. I could just stick a spotlight on the player's head, but that doesn't seem as fun. So I want to be able to pick something up and light the way. So first, I'm thinking something like a road flare, where you pick it up, light it, and it lights the way for a little while, and then burns out. So where do I start? Well, I think the flame for the flare would probably be best as a particle system. Particle systems have a lot of tunable parameters that you tweak until it starts spitting out the thing you're looking for. I used a particle system for the dirt to spoop out some rocks when you break a dirt chunk and for the trash be gone. The flare will be pretty close to the player though since they're holding it, so I want it to actually feel like a real flare. So it needs to have the actual whitish reddish flame, some smoke, and the light needs to sort of flicker in and out. While I've played with particle systems before, I can't say I've really made good looking systems. So to start out, I found a tutorial by this guy for making a fire particle system in Godot. I mean, I'm not making a torch, but I figured a fire is a good place to start, and then I'll probably tweak it a bit to look more like a flare. So it takes quite a bit of tuning to get something that kind of looks fluid enough to look like a fire. In his tutorial, once you get particles that sort of look like a fire, then you apply an animated sprite sheet to the particles, and then color it with a gradient. He also goes over how to add smoke to the fire and some sparks, which is great since I want some smoke and sparks for my flare. Snakes and sparklers are the only ones I like. But yeah, I definitely recommend this guy's tutorial if you want to make a fire particle system of your own. Alright, so I have a fire, so I tweaked it a bit, and ended up with my reddish flare flame, which I think it looks alright. For the texture, I sorta of just found a paperish material, and colorized it red, and put some logos and warning stuff on there to make it look a little more realistic. Sweet. So I popped everything into Godot, made the flare a pickupable object, and made it so once you grab the flare, you can activate it, and it'll burn for a while and then disappear. Of course I added some sound effects and made the light flicker in and out a bit, instead of just having one light level. I think it's pretty neat. Alright, I have a flare, but I also want a flashlight. Essentially, you can use your energy to power your flashlight, but that would drain down your energy as you use it. The flare doesn't drain your energy, but it only lasts a little while and then fizzles out. So I spooped up a flashlight model in Blender, and then popped it into the game engine, and set it up so that like the flare, you can pick it up, and activate it to turn on the light, which starts draining your energy. And when you deactivate it, it turns the light off, and stops draining your energy. Both the flare and the flashlight feels pretty good in the game, so I'm pretty happy so far. Anyway dudes, that's all I got. See ya!